The new show is called uh, it's called Parenthood. Of course, it's the uh, the adaptation of the 1989 film that uh, that Ron Howard did. How much? I know he's one of the producers. How much is he on the set? How much input does he have? His I think his input is more funneled through Jason Kadams, our writer. Right. They have a relationship previously from um, Ron producing and Jason writing Friday Night Lights, which is such a good show. Oh, it's um, the best. Thing love on love TV. that show too. We love that show. Isn't it so good? It's we're it's kind of ridiculous. We're pretty obsessed fans um, on the Parenthood set, but um, but yeah, Ron is basically he he called the whole cast individually and told each of us how proud he is of the show and um, how good he thinks it is. And he's been he's been a real you know a real strong advocate out there for all of us, which is so it makes us so proud. When he calls so you, does, when he calls you, does he say, uh, Erica, this is Opie? <laughs> um, Erica Richie Cunningham no. here. Like when he calls you on the phone, can you tell that he's always wearing a hat? <laughs> yes, you can hear the hat. Now, you can definitely hear the hat. Uh, this is a is a giant ensemble cast with a lot of names out there. When going into this, I mean, you in your own right have been acting for years, and you've been in some fantastic movies and and, and, and shows before. So it's not like this is your first rodeo. But were you starstruck by anybody on the set? Starstruck, not so much, but. Super excited. Um, Craig T. Nelson has kind of just stolen everyone's heart. Do you just it's, call him Coach? Because I, I think if I talked to him, I would ever, I would just have to call him Coach just from all the years <laughs> on, on TV. We actually, we call him Craig T. Or we call him anything T. Nelson, like <laughs> Pants T. Nelson, um, <laughs> Giggles T. Nelson. I don't, anything T. Nelson is really what goes with that. But yeah, or, or Pops. Uh, I call him Dad. Oh, that's too. nice. How did your father feel about that? <laughs> I think well, my father loved it. If your dad, if if I told my dad, Dad, Hayden Fox is going to replace you as my dad, he would say, "Okay, that's cool." <laughs> he he would he'd be into it, right? Yes. Yeah. Totally. Thought I lost to the better man. Yeah. <laughs> Come in. <laughs> well, Erica, I know you've been on, you've done some television series in the past, but there are two people. You are one of them in this show. You and Dak Shepard that I just associate with movies. So, what was it like making the move to TV? Well, what was, the, I guess, um, the appeal of making the move to TV? Dax and I have so thoroughly enjoyed this process and realized we've been missing out this whole time. I mean, not really because parenthood is something that's really special to us. And Dax and I have known each other for, like, I guess, eight years. And, uh, and yeah, we were, we, were, we were movie kids. But, yeah, we're just thrilled. Do you give him a lot of crap about his days on Punked? No. I, I knew him then, and he was brilliant. Mm-hmm. Because that's mean, when I originally saw him, he was he was the guy on Punked, and he was always the one going around and you know getting celebrities and things like that. And then he then I saw him and watched him get into the movie roles later on. So is it? Are yeah. you guys ever afraid that he's going to go back into his old ways on set or anything like that? Um, <laughs> no, is my guard always up? No, fortunately. But um, he's you can see that that improv, you know, the improv skills that that made him. So brilliant on punk is what makes him so fun to be around as a human being and also so great on the show. Just the stuff that comes out of his mouth, it's like you see it, you see the rest of us laughing. That's real because we didn't know that he was gonna say that so much of the time on Parenthood. Like it's a it's a very loose atmosphere, so we all get to kinda play around and have some spontaneity to it. But Dax definitely he, he tends to win in the category. We are uh, talking to Erica Christensen. The new show is Parenthood on NBC Tuesday nights at 9 o'clock. Now, uh, Erica, our uh, our traffic girl, Robin Fox, uh, knows you. It's a little bit different in age here. I, you know, when I think of you, I think of you from Traffic and mm-hmm. how that movie did not beat Gladiator for Best Picture, I'll never understand. But I digress. Uh. She knows you from <laughs> Swim Fan. And when we said, hey, we're, we're talking to Erica Christensen today, the first thing she said is, Oh, she was crazy at Swim Fan. I said, yeah, but that's a movie. She goes, no, no, it's in her eyes. She's really crazy. <laughs> so, <laughs> so would you like to dispute anything here? Or, or are you, in fact, crazy? <laughs> I'll believe what you will. Um, <laughs> no, I, it's funny. I was working when that came out, and the actors that I was working with were scared of me. I was like, come on, guys. Really? Come on. <laughs> Did that movie affect your personal life at all? Did you see anybody, and they were like, oh, that's that crazy girl from Swim Fan. I'm not getting anywhere near her. <laughs> um, it was the opposite. I don't know what it says about men that they like the crazy girl. Oh, we do. But <laughs> you do. Yes, we do. Oh, no, we do. We do. Um, <laughs> but yeah, I got a lot of like 
Oh, you're, you know, it's funny, the exact words that I got, and I couldn't tell if it was with regards to traffic or with regards to swim fan, because Mm -hmm. it could go either way, and I got it from a lot of (laughs) men and a lot of women, but the (laughs) comment I got was, you're bad, and that's the sentence that I heard (laughs) so much around that time. As long as you weren't hearing it from casting directors. No, exactly. (laughs) (laughs) If it was a guy, I assumed he was talking about a swim fan. If it was a woman, I assumed she was talking about traffic. So after traffic, a lot of meth heads coming up and thinking, you're bad. Oh my God. And Swim Fan no, was like, I'll make you less crazy. Yeah. <laughs> yes, if there are two things we've learned about Erica Christensen, we don't want to do meth with her or have sex with her in a swimming pool. No. <laughs> that brings out the crazy. The, the swimming pool brings out the crazy. It does. <laughs> Very observant of you. <laughs> Erica Christensen, the show is uh, Parenthood on NBC Tuesday nights at 9 o'clock. Erica, thanks for taking the time. You bet. Thank you.